everyone, this is Lucy and I'm excited to bring you along a day in my life at Salesforce TDX where I'll be diving into the world of AI agents. I am looking forward to exploring Agent Force, checking out the different sessions and learning about how AI agents are transforming the way we work. If that sounds interesting to you, make sure you stick around because it's going to be a fun day. All right, let's head in now. Time to go explore the campground. Okay, so I just came out of the keynote session and wow, Salesforce dropped some pretty huge updates. One of the biggest updates is that AI agents are now transforming the way businesses operate. At the end of last year, Salesforce launched a digital labor platform called Agent Force, which allows enterprises to create a limitless workforce. With this, AI is no longer just an assistant. It can act as a subject matter expert, helping you make real-time decisions as well as reduce manual tasks. Fast forward to today, Salesforce is now making Agent Force a lot more accessible to the public through the launch of Agent Exchange. This is a new marketplace that allows businesses to find, try, and implement AI solutions from over 200 different partners, including Google Cloud, DocuSign, and Box. Instead of spending months developing your own AI automation, you can now use pre-built AI solutions instantly. All right, let's grab some lunch now and head to our next session. So now I'm going to build my own AI agent. Let's see how it goes. Is there a showcase? Well, you saw in the keynote that we had a hackathon. So without further ado, Maham, you're up first. I'm Maham Hassan. I am Salesforce Technical Architect, Salesforce MVP, and Developer Group Leader in Dubai. And on top of that, I'm a mom of two boys and three beautiful cats. If I'll take you to the back end of this booking, you can see that I have a confirmed flight. The prompt really starts when it's built by the agent. That award goes to Pradeep. Congratulations, Pradeep. Hey everyone, so I'm here with Kristoff, Head of Technical Audience Relations at Salesforce. So Kristoff, what has been your favorite announcement at Salesforce TDX so far? It has to be the developer edition because it's now enabled with Agent Force and Data Cloud. And that's really something that the developer audience has been asking for a long time. They can now explore building agents and they can explore bringing their data together. So that was the number one request and I'm so excited that we delivered. It. So during the keynote, we heard the word Agent Force a lot. We both yes. know what it is, but for those who are not familiar with Agent Force, how would you describe it? We call it the digital labor platform.
platform. So at the same time, it's the thing that allows you to extend uh, your workforce in a kind of a limitless capability. Think about always on support agents and things like that. But if I think about it from a developer point of view, it's really that platform that allows you to kind of customize agents, build new agents. It's, you know, everything you need from your data layer to the tools that you need to build these agents, whether they are low code or pro code, that's really agent force. And earlier today, I've even tried to build my own AI agent. So pretty much anyone can get started. What would you say would be the biggest challenge with businesses getting started with using AI agents? I think the biggest challenge is to change your mindset. If you think about traditional development, you are used to end-to-end -end development. You're given a set of requirements and then you build the application. The application covers all the potential path that the logic can take. If you think about agents, it's really different because agents are capable of orchestrating the different workflows. So I would say the biggest challenge is really understanding how you build these applications in a different way. That's really interesting. So Salesforce has just released a new report that said 96% of developers are excited about AI agents and its impact on the developer experience. For those who are just really interested in getting started and not sure where to go, what advice would you have for them? As a developer myself, the way I learned a new technology was always to play with it and experience it. So that would be my number one advice. So at Salesforce, we have plenty of activities to support you in that exploration. Here at the conference, we have Trailhead. We also had a hackathon. You just need to play with it, experience it. And that's when you're going to really start developing these incredible game changer agents. So experience it is my top advice. I agree. Best way to learn something is to go and build. Thank Thank you so much for your time today. You're welcome. Thank you. Hey everyone, so I'm here with Maham, Salesforce Architect at Cloud One. Maham, how's your journey been so far in Salesforce TDX? It's going amazing, it's fantastic. The energy here is electric. Everything that we need to know, we have the answers here for agents and this is something that we were looking for. Nice, and I actually joined your Agent Force Showcase just then and it was really cool what you built. So I wanted to hear more about how did you get started with the world of AI and AI agents? Well, this is six months back, Agent Force was introduced and we have to just start digging and looking into how businesses and how our customers can actually leverage Agent Force because this is a fast evolving pace of AI. Everyone is trying to furnish their businesses and equip them with AI. So this is something that even Salesforce customers are looking for. And that's how basically I started getting to know about AI agents and I started learning it. Amazing. What are your thoughts on the future of AI and AI agents? I know people who are not really in this space have a lot of speculation on whether AI will replace jobs. Uh, what are your thoughts on that? Replacement is not a good term. AI cannot replace your job, but the people with the AI skills surely will. In terms of the future of the agents, it's about how human can decide and work on the more strategic side of the businesses while agents can do the repetitive and manual tasks. So I'm very excited for the future and the future of AI is right here at Agent Force. Amazing. So for those who are interested in building these AI skills and building their own AI agent, how can they get started? I started learning about agents on Trailhead. So as soon as something is announced, Salesforce take the responsibility and there is a structured path for everyone who want to get started with Agent Force. So my go-to advice is to just go to Trailhead and start learning. everyone, we're at the Salesforce office and look who I bumped into. How's it going guys? We got Tech with Lucy, Tech with Tim, perfect combo here. How's your experience been at the Salesforce conference? Yeah, it's been super cool. There's just so much stuff going on, so I have to pick uh, what I want to attend. But learning about all the AI agent stuff, it's, it's kind of crazy what you can do on the Salesforce platform, especially as I usually code it all out from scratch and then I'm seeing on screen them, you know, building my three hour coding sessions in like five minutes. So it's uh, kind of game changing. 